So we're celebrating Fourth of July early, as you may have just heard there. Eating hot dogs, that's a tradition for a lot of folks on Independence Day. The barbecue. Mm, Got to do it. Yeah. This morning, we're stopping by American Coney Island at Fremont Street to find out how we can step up our game when it comes to those dogs. <laughs> Hector Mejia, live in downtown with the details. Hector, where's your hat? <laughs> Hey there, so I had to take a little bit of a break from that hat, but here is one of the hot dogs here, and it's like raining hot dogs here at American Coney Island, and we're learning how to make the best hot dog on earth, especially with 4th uh, of July coming up in just a few days. Joining us here, we have General Manager Mario to tell us, all right, just about how many people are you guys expecting for this crowded weekend? Oh, it should be packed this weekend, guys. Uh, welcome back, and uh, we're, we're, we're looking for a great turnout. So with this giant party plan in Vegas this weekend, you know, a lot of restaurants, including this one, are preparing to host thousands of people. And here we have uh, some hot dogs here. Tell us, how can we make the best hot dog and end up with something really delicious? Uh, it's simple, guys. Chili, mustard, onions on uh, a natural casing hot dog. Is there a perfect ratio? Maybe not too much mustard or maybe not too much chili, or is that really not such a thing. You don't want to overpower with the mustard, uh, just a little bit on the mustard, and then we, uh, you know, uh, the, the hot dog is the mm -hmm. showcase item there, and then the chili and uh, the onions for a little bit of taste. Perfect. So we're also profiling American Coney Island, the company been around for more than 100 years. Yes, 104 years in business, family owned and operated out of Detroit, Michigan, uh, here in Las Vegas uh, since 2012 at the D Las Vegas. And how long here along Fremont Street? Uh, one more time. How long have you guys been here along Fremont oh, 2012 Street? 2012 is when we, we first came out, uh, when the D opened up. All right, so uh, keeping it PG, what's one of the craziest uh, stories you've seen here along Fremont Street? Uh, <laughs> Gotta ask, I mean, you see it all. This place is open 24 hours. Yeah, sometimes, you know, we see some stuff we want to yeah. see, some stuff we don't want to see, <laughs> but it's all in good fun. <laughs> You know, you guys were busy here earlier as soon as we all, we, when we got here, there was a guy that walked in, he was like, what do you say? He said, I'm from Minneapolis. We are like, hey, sir, we're about to go live in just a few seconds. Uh, well, being that, uh, you know, it's the tourism capital of the world, everybody wants to say where they're from, and uh, we love it. Come awesome. on down. Looking forward to 4th of July, definitely. Absolutely. Yeah, happy 4th, everyone, and uh, looking forward to, you know, serving everyone and uh, with our delicious product. Thank you, sir. Yeah. So uh, there you go. Uh, you know, I actually ate a couple of hot dogs, so I'm going to take a break, but I believe this is next. Some delicious chili cheese fries. I think I need some extra cheese, though. I love that extra cheese on my chili cheese fries. <laughs> Back to you guys. That's animal style right there. Oh, yeah. Oh, man, that Many looks animals. good. Oh, it sure is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's all part of a well-balanced breakfast, Hector. Thank you very much. Uh, mm -hmm. The staff there seem energized, ready to uh, go this morning. Him, and, uh, yeah, absolutely. In fact, he, he, he needs to tone it down, that GM. He's, he's, dialed, he's <laughs> a little bit, a little bit over the top. <laughs> Dial it back a little bit. <laughs> Thanks, Hector. Appreciate that, sir. It is, it's, it's that time, right? Fourth Thank of July. You. It's mm -hmm. your hot dogs, your hamburgers, your barbecues. Mm -hmm. It's just, it's part of what you do. It is. Hector, Put those in a to-go bag, by the way. Please. Don't forget. I need a chili dog. <laughs> right. So some friends called to ask if we wanted to come over and, and chow with them on Sunday. Right. And they were like, uh, well, we're thinking about doing a barbecue. Would you rather have hamburgers? Yeah. And I was like, burgers are good. And yeah. then they texted again and said, would you rather do ribs? I was like, ribs are really good. <laughs> so, yes, please. Okay. So no more burgers. Yeah. Burgers are out. Well, if they're going to give us the option, which one would you choose? Yeah. All, both. Okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. All right, there. All, 